If you're new here, hi, I'm Kelly. Recently, I went to Penang with my family for a quick getaway, and here's part two of that trip. And yeah, this was supposed to be posted like some time ago, but I got busy with exams, so please bear with me. If you haven't watched part one, I'll link it in the corner and in the description box below. But this video is about the rest of my trip in Penang. Visiting pretty cafes and places along with some time spent for Chinese New Year back in our hometown. I can't wait to share with you guys all the food I ate and all the fun memories made. So please get ready and I hope you enjoy. So this was a bit funny because we stood there for like 10 to 15 minutes trying to figure out the opening to this cafe but in the end we realized it was supposed to rotate clockwise in a full 360 rotation in order to open and this was a bit funny because like we almost decided that this was a scam and we almost like u-turn and was about to find another cafe to go but in the end all is good we figure out the opening to this door and we ate the food and yeah it was a good experience except for this door <laughs> Out of nowhere, oh, and then yeah. we're going to Armenian Street. Tonight, I don't feel good enough to put up a fight. I hate when I'm still up to see the morning light. When everyone's on earth, but I'm a satellite. But when I can't climb, and I'm falling at my landing on your mind. I've got my whole damn life, but I still don't have time. Was just starting to see. Hi, 2020 vision. Hi, this is perfect vision. You put on contact lens? Right. For the first time in I don't know how many days. Since I last moved sports. And now you have perfect vision. Me. Perfectly enlightened. You? Me too. Yeah. We're now going to eat lunch with uh, my parents' friends and my friends. I think we're going to this like Chinese cafe. Yeah, with like a bunch of traditional food. I don't know, we'll see. Searching for food for so long, but here at Gurney, what? Gurney Plaza. Yeah, to eat. So this mall, apparently there's like no other food downstairs to eat. So everyone in this mall was cramped upstairs in the food hall. That's why there was a long queue waiting to get a table and even get into the place. Like everyone else, we queued for our table. But luckily there was like a lot of options up here. So all is good. The food was actually really, really good as well. So yeah. So yeah, after 
our two hour road journey, everyone was tired and exhausted. I think we just kind of settled down and rested at our grandma's place for a while. And right now it's dinner time. So today um, is 31st of January and it's Lunar New Year's Eve, which is quite a big day. I think it's even bigger than like the first day of Chinese New Year. Hey, 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 fact check please. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys what we're gonna eat and it's gonna be all good food. So yeah. a really really big fireworks in front of our house and I don't know whether this is safe or not but it looks like it had like at least a hundred I don't know fireworks out of the box so it's gonna be really really loud and really really so today is Day one of Chinese New Year and usually we eat vegetarian on this day. So yeah, we're gonna eat vegetarian. There's a lot of like mock meats and veggies and it's really really good because I don't know, there's like no killing on the first day of Chinese New Year which is really really good. So after our chandel, we decided to go for a walk around the neighborhood because I don't know, maybe my grandma was preparing dinner or something like that. But we had some time on our hands, so we just walked around and explored the village. And it was really nice because like we seldom do this and we got to explore a lot of stuff we don't really get to see in the city. So yeah. It's the second day of Chinese New Year and we have nothing to do so we're going to our yearly tradition, the mall. Um, usually we just go to the mall because during Chinese New Year it's really really hot so that's a place where there's aircon and where it's comfortable. So yeah, we're going there now and I don't know what we're gonna buy but mostly for the aircon, yeah. <laughs> From the day I called you mine And you broke down the walls inside me Whoa, Before you knew me I was swift jeans And cold feet scared to wear my heart on my sleeve We're buying sushi for tonight's dinner Today is Chu San or Chu Si. I think it's the third day of Chinese New Year, and 
our whole family is going to the beach or like the seaside to eat dinner so there's gonna be a lot of sea creatures um so at first i thought i wasn't going because i have tuition every thursday and my tuition never skips but today uh apparently it's i don't know there's no tuition so yeah we're all going Ooh, here we go Our last day of Chinese New Year like in our hometown and we're going back today we're supposed to go back like right after lunch but we sort of I don't know took our time to do things and yeah we're just about to go off but my brother wants to eat his last black noodles or like soy sauce noodles after that we're definitely going back so yeah Had a chance to stick around with a nigga, now you stuck. Got in my bag, now I'm up. Made a couple transactions last week, and now I'm lit as fuck.